Hi everybody, it's Mrs. Murphy from the Upton Town Library. Welcome to today's baby story time all about parts of the body. So let's get started with our welcome song the way we always do. The more we get together. Ready? The more we get together, together, together. The more we get together, the happier we'll be. For your friends are my friends and my friends are your friends. The more we get together, the happier we'll be. Now let's do the more we sing together. The more we sing together, together, together. The more we sing together, the happier we'll be. For your friends are my friends and my friends are your friends. The more we sing together, the happier we'll be. Yay! Well done, everybody. Welcome, welcome. It's good to see you. Let's do a couple book talks. I have two books for you today. And the first one is called, Where is Baby's Belly Button? Can you see it? It's right there. So this is by Karen Katz, and she's written many of these Where is Baby's uh, books, and they all have these great flaps you can lift. So this one says, Where are Baby's Eyes? Under her hat. And then you can have your baby point to the eyes to kind of touch each eye. And it goes on and on with different body parts. Let me find another one. Where are baby's hands? Under the bubbles. And then you can say, clap your hands and do things like that to get them to know their body parts. And at the end, we always find baby. Where is baby? There he is. And babies just love all the flaps you lift in her books. So this is part of a series and on the back you can see some of her other titles um, that we have and then others you can order from other libraries. But Lifting the Flaps are a great, great kind of books, uh, kind of book for the little ones. Another series I like is this Hello World series. This is by Jill McDonald and this is called My Body. You can see on the back she's got lots of different ones. This is Baby's first introduction to nonfiction books. So they have some rhyme. From the top of your head to the tips of your toes, your body can do so many things. Maybe it doesn't rhyme, sorry. <laughs> blink, blink, you use your eyes to see the world around you. Take a look, isn't the sunset pretty? And then you can point to eyes and you can say, can you blink, baby? And see if they can blink or touch their eyes. And this has all the different body parts. So here we have ears, they can touch their ears. What do you hear? And it does all the different parts of the body. Your body is constantly growing. Lots of sleep, good food, and plenty of exercise will help it stay strong and healthy. And then you can point to all the different kids in the picture. Um, it's great to just point to different things. So this is called My Body by Jill McDonald. I love her books. Did you like the books today? Let's start with some songs. Let's do Hello. And this one, I've got some friends with me today. So I think first we're going to sing to the giraffe. So let's sing this way. Hello, giraffe, how are you? How are you? How are you? Hello, giraffe, how are you? How are you today? I'm fine. <laughs> Who's going to be next? How about we meet the monkey? Let's say hello, monkey. Hello, monkey, how are you? How are you? How are you? Hello, monkey, how are you? How are you today? Ooh, 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 ooh. I'm fine, how are you? Got one more friend to meet. Let's see who it is. Roar, it's a tiger. So let's sing hello, tiger. Hello, tiger, how are you? How are you? How are you? Hello, tiger, how are you? How are you today? Roar, I'm fine. How are you today? Are you good? Awesome, that's great. Let's do this little piggy. So take your fingers. We're going to use our thumbs. Thumb is our first piggy. And then we'll count the little piggies with our fingers. Ready? This little piggy went to market. This little piggy stayed home. This little piggy had roast beef. And this little piggy had none. And this little piggy cried, all the way home. Let's do our other hand. Ready? You can reach your toes. You can do your toes too. I'm going to start with my thumb. 
This little piggy went to market. This little piggy stayed home. This little piggy had roast beef. And this little piggy had none. And this little piggy cried, wee, 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 all the way home. Did you get some good tickles on that one? I hope so. Let's do a song called Ten Little Fingers. So I want to get your fingers ready. And it goes like this. Let's sing. One little, two little, three little fingers. Four little, five little, six little fingers. Seven little, eight little, nine little fingers. Ten little fingers on my hands. They clap and they clap and they keep on clapping. They clap and they clap and they keep on clapping. They clap and they clap and they keep on clapping. Ten little fingers on my hands. They wiggle and they wiggle and they wiggle all together. They wiggle and they wiggle and they wiggle all together. They wiggle and they wiggle and they wiggle all together. Ten little fingers on my hands. Can we try that one more time? Did you like that part? Let's do it again. Ready? Let's count. One little, two little, three little fingers. Four little, five little, six little fingers. Seven little, eight little, nine little fingers. Ten little fingers on my hands. They clap and they clap and they keep on clapping. They clap and they clap and they keep on clapping. They clap and they clap and they keep on clapping. Ten little fingers on my hands. They wiggle and they wiggle and they wiggle all together. They wiggle and they wiggle and they wiggle all together. They wiggle and they wiggle and they wiggle all together. Ten little fingers on my hands. Excellent job. Did you tap each finger when we were counting? Families, you can help tap your kids' fingers if they can't do it themselves. All right, let's do a new one. This is a lap bounce. It's called Jelly in the Bowl. So I'm going to use my baby for this one. And the first one we're going to do is we're going to wibble and wobble, kind of like we're jelly. We're wibble, wiggle, wobble. Then we're going to count our fingers like they're candles, 10 candles, and then we'll blow them out. And then we'll shake up the biscuits in the tin. So we'll shake them up, shake them up. All right, let's try it. Jelly in the bowl, jelly in the bowl. Wibble wobble, wibble wobble, jelly in the bowl. Candles on the cake, candles on the cake. Blow them out, blow them out. Candles on the cake. Biscuits in the tin, biscuits in the tin. Shake them up, shake them up. Biscuits in the tin. Did you shake up those biscuits in your hands? Let's do it again. Ready? Jelly in the bowl, jelly in the bowl. Wibble wobble, wibble wobble, jelly in the bowl. Candles on the cake, candles on the cake. Blow them out, blow them out. Candles on the cake. Blow them out. Biscuits in the tin, biscuits in the tin. Shake them up, shake them up. Biscuits in the tin. You help your kids shake them up. Take their hands and make the biscuits in the tin. Well done. Let's do a little Grand Old Duke of York. I think you remember this one. Here we go. Oh, the Grand Old Duke of York. He had 10,000 men. He marched them up to the top of the hill and he marched them down again. And when they were up, they were up. And when they were down, they were down. And when they were only halfway up, they were neither up nor down. So make sure you take your kids and put them up and down. Or kids, if you can do it yourself, you can stand up and down yourself. Let's do it one more time. Oh, the grand old Duke of York, he had 10,000 men. He marched them up to the top of the hill and he marched them down again. And when they were up, they were up. And when they were down, they were down. And when they were only halfway up, they were neither up nor down. Wonderful job. I know kids love going up and down like that. You'll get lots of smiles with that one. Can we do a little head, shoulders, knees, and toes? I'm going to stand up for this one. And for this one, you have to touch your head, your shoulders, your knees, and your toes. You can't see my toes, but they're down there. So families, help your kids touch all the different parts. Are you ready? Here we go. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes. Knees and toes, head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes, and eyes and ears, and mouth and nose. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. One more time. 
Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Eyes and ears and mouth and nose. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Excellent job. Families, even if your kids can't stand up, you can help touch each part as you go along. Let's do I'm a little teapot. So you can stand up or you can sit up and you're going to be a teapot. So you need a handle and a spout. And then eventually we're going to change sides. So we'll do it two times. Here we go. I'm a little teapot, short and stout. Here is my handle. Here is my spout. When I get all steamed up, hear me shout. Just tip me over and pour me out. I'm a special teapot, it is true. Here, let me show you what I can do. I can change my handle and my spout. Just tip me over and pour me out. Excellent job. It's good to get both sides of our bodies moving like that. All right, let's do some instruments. If you have an instrument, get it out now. I'm gonna use my maraca today. If you don't have an instrument, you can make one. This is a, an old spice container. Can you hear it? What do you think it is? It's rice. There's rice inside there and I glued it shut. And I put pretty tape on it so it's my own shaker. Maybe I'll use that today. How about that? How about I use my homemade instrument? I think that'll be more fun. Let's do if you're happy and you know it. If you're happy and you know it, give a shake. If you're happy and you know it, give a shake. If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, give a shake. If you're happy and you know it, give a clap. If you're happy and you know it, give a clap. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it, if you're happy and you know it, give a clap. If you're happy and you know it, tap your toes. If you're happy and you know it, tap your toes. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it, if you're happy and you know it, tap your toes. Good job, everybody. How about we shake to Hey Diddle Diddle? Do you know that one? Let's do it. Hey Diddle Diddle. The cat and the fiddle. The cow jumped over the moon. The little dog laughed to see such sport and the dish ran away with the spoon. Let's do it again. Hey diddle diddle, the cat and the fiddle. The cow jumped over the moon. The little dog laughed to see such sport and the dish ran away with the spoon. Well done, good job keeping the rhythm. How about we do, do you know the muffin man? Let's sing that one with our shakers. Here we go. Do you know the muffin man, the muffin man, the muffin man? Do you know the muffin man who lives on Drury Lane? Yes, I know the muffin man, the muffin man, the muffin man. Yes, I know the muffin man who lives on Drury Lane. Yes, we know the muffin man, the muffin man, the muffin man. Yes, we know the muffin man who lives on Drury Lane. Good job. That's one of my favorite songs. How about we do Jack in the Box? Can you fit your shaker in your hand? Try not to make it peek. Let's do Jack in the Box. It goes like this. Jack in the Box sits so still. Will he come out? Yes, he will. And let it pop up and shake it. Let's do it again. Jack in the Box Sit so still. Will he come out? Yes, he will. You can jump and shake it as loud as you can. All right, let's do a little where is Thumpkin. So let's put our instruments away. Get your thumbs ready. Here we go. Hide them behind your back. And let's do it. Where is Thumpkin? Where is Thumpkin? Here I am. Here I am. How are you today, sir? Very well, I thank you. Run away, run away. Can we do that one more time? Let's try it. Hide your thumbs behind your back. Don't let me see them. Let's do it. Where is Thumpkin? 
Where is Thumpkin? Here I am. Here I am. How are you today, sir? Very well, I thank you. Run away. Run away. Wonderful job. And at home you can do, where is Pointer? Where is Tall Man? Where is Ring Man? And where is Pinky? Those are tricky ones to do, but thumbs are easy to do. Can we do a little twinkle twinkle and finish up? Get your twinkling stars ready. Here we go. Twinkle twinkle little star, how I wonder what you are. Up above the world so high, like a diamond in the sky. Twinkle twinkle little star, how I wonder what you are. Excellent job. Clap for yourselves. You did a great job at story time today. Be sure to tune in next week for our next baby story time. Feel free to watch these videos as often as you like. Repetition's important. Kids learn from repetition. That's why we do a lot of the same songs over and over. And be sure to watch us on social media and our website, uptonlibrary.org, for announcements. Bye, guys. See you soon.